the J. <laughs> and I'll be your instructor. We're gonna start with a basic takeoff. Hold the throttle all the way down to pick up speed, and pull back on the stick to take off. You can retract your landing gear once you're a safe distance above the ground. Congratulations, pilot! You are now airborne. Now, navigate through those checkpoints marked on your radar, and we can move on to the next lesson. That was a good start! Well done! Now I'm gonna have you attempt a safe landing on the runway. You won't have Start reducing the plane's altitude gradually so you're just above the runway as you approach. Be sure to deploy the landing gear before you reach the runway. Start to decelerate while you're still in the air, but be careful not to stall the engines. When you touch down, continue to apply the brakes carefully until you come to a complete stop. Try to land as close as you can to the checkpoint marked on the runway. Executed like a pro! Now let's get the plane off the runway. Taxi over to the marked area and come to a complete stop. In this lesson, you're going to be performing a couple of different stunts. We'll start you out with a few barrel rolls. And if that goes well, you can take a crack at flying upside down. All right, pilot. It's time for us to get a little crazy. First, I want you to get some altitude and head for that checkpoint marked at the end of the runway. Good. Okay. Let's see what you got. On my mark, perform a barrel roll by pulling your flight stick to the left or right. Okay, perform a barrel roll. Stones of steel! <laughs> I like it! Now let's try a few of those in a row. Level out your plane and get ready. I want to see you do three barrel rolls in a row on my signal. Watch your altitude on this one. Okay, perform three barrel rolls in a row. Very nice! Are you getting dizzy in there yet? Go ahead and level out the plane again. Now let's see how you do upside down. On my word, roll over the plane and hold it steady. Okay, roll the plane upside down. Hold the plane upside down for several seconds. Roll the plane right side up. Great work out there today. I'll teach you some more moves next time. lesson will help you build your stick and rudder skills. You have to keep your plane steady while rolled over on either side. Perfecting this trick will really come in handy in the later lessons. Take off and head for the checkpoint marked at the runway. Then, I'll talk you through it. A knife is one of the harder moves. You'll have to keep your wings steady and use your rudders to maintain altitude. When I give you the signal, I want you to try to hold a knife edge with your plane. Okay, perform a knife edge. Perfect, now hold that position. Don't forget to use your rudders to maintain altitude. Good, let's see if you can do the same thing on the other 
side. On my mark, roll your plane over to the opposite side and hold the position. Okay, perform a knife edge on the other side. Level out the plane. <laughs> that was an amazing run! You should be very proud of yourself. Obstacle course is designed to teach you how to get better control over your turns. The course goes around. I want you to use everything you've learned so far to navigate this course as fast as you can. Watch your altitude, though. This is really a test of how low you can go and how well you can maneuver the plane. I'm going to teach you how to perform an emergency landing. Remember to begin decelerating while you are still... and head for the mark. 
marker at the end of the runway. Some pilots find these moves particularly tricky, so it might take you a few tries. Always make sure your plane is straightened out before you attempt an inside loop. On my mark, pull back hard on the flight stick and hold it. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. That wasn't too bad for a rookie. Let's try it again. Just like before, steady the plane first, wait for my signal, and then pull back hard on the flight stick. Okay, perform an inside loop. Get ready to level out the plane when you're near the end of the loop. Now we're talking! You're doing good so far. I think we can squeeze in one more stunt. We'll combine the inside loop with the barrel roll to perform a roll off the top. Start with an inside loop, but only go halfway. When you're fully inverted, then roll the plane over. Now, when I give you the go-ahead, yank the flight stick back as hard as you can. Ready? Perform a roll off the top. Now, roll the plane right side up. You've been doing so well in the plane, we're going to put you in a helicopter for this lesson. There are a few more controls than the... Let's go on a short tour of the city, and we'll see how well you handle the chopper. Follow the marked course, and remember, I'm looking for maneuverability, but also speed.
are looking good. Looking solid. You're heading into the city now. Watch out for street lights and buildings.
pad. Go ahead and set her down nice and easy. Nice job! You handled the course pretty well. lesson, but with a real emphasis on speed. Remember, this course is all about speed. And to maximize acceleration, keep the nose of the helicopter tipped. Just bear in mind that you're also losing altitude when the nose is pointed down. Good work so far! Keep her at full speed! Awesome!
right, but we have some things to work on. Let's try that one again. 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 <laughs> 